Hey guys, this is Versatile from VSC Power, now hosted on Project Phoenix Media. In today's video game tutorial, it's an awesome one. There's no other YouTube video like this. I'm going to show you how you can emulate Xbox 360 game controller for the PC game, The Walking Dead. And we're going to use a PC USB, or in my case, I'm going to use an official Sony PlayStation 2 game controller with the twin USB joystick adapter. So let's do this. You are going to need two files. The first file is the X360 CE program. Go to this website here in the more info section. Download the latest version, 212.191. Download and extract that into your main Walking Dead folder. Also, we're going to need this other zip file. Go to tokaedit.com. Download Mirror over here. And you want this file called dinput8-x360cev21.zip file. Go ahead and download that into your Walking Dead folder. Once you have that zip file, double-click into it. Go into the spoofer folder and go ahead and drag out this dinput8 file. All right, excellent. So let's go ahead. Let's run the X360 CE program. And it's going to ask you to create an INI file as well as a DLL file. So let's go ahead and do that. And then uh, also I'm going to create a uh, search for settings for both my port 1 and also port 2 for my twin USB joystick adapter, which you can see in the bottom left corner of this video. So we go to controller 1. Let's test my buttons, A, B, X, Y, triggers, analogs, D-pass working. Excellent. Great. Now, one thing I do want to know is for whatever reason inside the game, my A is this button, my B is this button, my X, I, I said that backwards, A, B, X, Y. Yep, that's correct. So, A, B, X, Y. So, for whatever reason, my game, maybe your game too, your buttons will be, you know, map wrong for the A, B, X, Y, but that's okay. At least the directional buttons will work and you're good to go. So with that said, all you got to do is just start your game, and your game controller will be recognized automatically. So with that said, let's do this and have a lot of good times. All right, here we are in the main menu of the game. So let's do this. So if I see my PS2 game controller here in the camera, guys, press down. Awesome. It's automatically recognized. If I press my triangle key, it's recognized as the button A. Like I said, this is sort of screwed up, but hey, it works. You go to controls. Here you can see what the controls are for Xbox 360 game controller. So let's show you some proof that, yeah, this does work. So I'm going to go back, I'm going to go to uh, play here, I'm going to go ahead and resume a game that I was doing here earlier, and uh, let's continue the game here, and show you proof that, yeah, this does work with the dialogue, and, you know, show you proof that, yeah, this does work. So, bottom line, X360 CE program, download, extract into your game folder, and then also get that D input 8 zip file, and the spoofer version. Alright, look at this, awesome. Do that look on me, man. I'm not being an asshole, I'm being smart. No lights, no, uh, you know, they can't see us. Come on, let's get to the dialogue. Here we go, awesome. Let's do, uh, how stupid are you? How much stupid can you pull off tonight, man? Turn the fucking lights on. <laughs> That's stupid? what I'm talking about. Awesome. What? This is smart, so let's go ahead and Those guys uh, won't find us. Stop that. So there you go, that shows you proof. Game controller works with this Walking Dead, and it's awesome. So you guys have any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here. On YouTube page, I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.